Hello. Hello. How are you? Fine. And you? Okay, thanks. I'll just wait for some more people to join us. Yeah. Hey, Louisa. Hello, everybody. Got lots of room so you can come join us in class. Mm -hmm. How was everyone's weekend? Hey, sorry, I'm here. <laughs> <laughs> How was your weekend? Um, my weekend? It's yeah. already Sunday. Oh, it's you. You're in France. Sorry, I forgot that uh, we are in same time zone. Yeah. <laughs> it's Monday morning right now for me. Oh, yeah, for me too. Louisa, where do you live again? I'm in Armenia. Okay. So it's it's nine for me. It is nine uh, twelve. Eleven, twelve? It's eleven for me. <laughs> <laughs> so to warm up, I want you to tell me something that Nobody knows about you or something interesting about you. Just while we're waiting for some more people to join. So maybe we'll start with Mustafa. Something interesting about you, non-related to horses. <laughs> okay. <laughs> when I was a child, uh, I drank a seven up to my sheep. <laughs> You gave a sheep 7-Up? Like the, the soda? Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> yes. <laughs> what happened? Uh, his stomach uh, all down. <laughs> oh no. Did you get really sick? <laughs> I was in 4 years old. <laughs> what about you, Louise? Is that something interesting about you that we don't know? Um. Today was my first elections day. I go to elect president today. Yeah. It was excited. <laughs> cool. So you voted? <laughs> yep. This morning? Yes. Oh, cool. <laughs> it's your first time voting? Yep. Oh, wow. That's pretty 18. exciting. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Igor. Hey, Perkin. Hi. Perkin is in the dark. <laughs> hey, Igor, can you tell us something interesting about yourself? Sorry? Can you tell us something interesting about yourself? Your name, where you're from, and something interesting about yourself. I'm Igor. I'm from Republic of Moldova. And uh, I'm average guy. Okay. <laughs> and uh, hey, Perkin. Are you able Hi. to chat? Yes. Why are you, why are you in the dark? <laughs> <laughs> it's a computer lab, but there's no one inside. Oh, okay. Shouldn't you be in school? This is a different school. It's break time, and it takes 30 minutes. Ah, okay. So tell us something interesting about yourself. Like what? <laughs> I don't know. Something you've done before, like for example, Mustafa told us that one time he fed, he gave a sheep seven up. <laughs> gave a sheep what? Seven up the soda <laughs> when he was a little kid. Oh, I remember something that I burned four ping pong balls and smelled its odor and I was going to die. <laughs> oh my goodness. Yeah, you're not supposed to smell burning plastic. That's probably not good for you. <laughs> if he aches. Crazy. Hi. Hey, okay. How are you? Nice, and you? It's good, my first thanks. time here, so <laughs> sorry for okay. my bad English. <laughs> nice to meet you. Yep. Thank you. Where are you from? From Russia. Okay, cool. 
And hi, Toyet. Sorry, one more time. Yeah. Sorry, hi. I'm saying hello to Toyet. Hi, how are you? Hi, I'm fine, thanks. How about you? Good, thanks. And yes. can you tell us something interesting about yourself? Yeah. Nothing interesting. <laughs> yeah. Hi, Zinyu. Zinyu, are you there? Hi, sir. Hi, how are you? I'm fine. Cool. So, today um, we're going to be talking about different pronunciations of. Um, words with O-U-G-H and A-U-G-H, and we're going to do some practice, so hopefully it will be helpful for you. Um, there's a document on Google Drive. I gave you the link in the chat, but I'll give it to you again. Um, let me know if you have any trouble accessing it. Is it working, Louisa? Yeah. Yes. Okay. There's the link again. Um, so first thing we're going to do is kind of um, read through it and talk about what different pronunciations there are. And I'll unfortunately tell you that it's really difficult to tell the difference and there aren't really any rules. <laughs> so it's kind of a memorization thing. But it's still good to know that there are all of these different pronunciations. And then after that we're going to do um, practice, play a game. Things like that. So um, I'm just going to share my screen. So you have the option of just looking off of my screen. Uh, here we go. I'm not sure if you, people from outside will be able to see this. Sorry if it doesn't work for you. So um, first we'll just kind of read through it. So maybe um, Igor, do you want to read the first paragraph? Yes. One of the strangest things in English pronunciation is the existence of words that contain the combination of letters O. Where these combinations has a different pronunciation from other words that also contain O. These letters usually appear at the ending of a word. Okay, Louisa, can you read the next part? Oh, yep. Uh. One of the big experts on English pronunciation has uh, called this the most extreme example of difficult pronunciation in English. However, these uh, sounds are basic and you need to learn them. Good. Uh, Firkin, can you read the next part? Which part we are in? There are six different sounds. Okay. There are six different sounds of ah in American English and sadly there are no rules to help you experience and practice <laughs> will teach you the sounds in a few weeks. This is one of those subjects that you can remember easily because it is so weird and unusual. Okay. And Mustafa? Mustafa? Okay. Toyet? Okay. I give, yeah, yep. I give below a list of these six different sounds. There are not many other examples, and these are the most common words you will meet. You have to memorize them. Good. Then you? Then you? you have, you have had some experience, you will be able to taste these sounds, reading them aloud. If a word sounds strange, it's probably wrong. Okay. Felix, can you read this sentence? Mm, from, for example, if... Yep. Okay, for example, the best known word on the list is probably enough. Uh, you may know this word very well. Good. Igor? It has the sound of. If you try to apply the of sound to another word, for instance, through, 
you will realize that there is no word in English that is pronounced through. Thruff, yeah. Thruff. So obviously in through it's not the uff sound, so through it is not thruff. Um, in other words, the subject is simple if you open your ears. Uh, Louisa, can you just read the last two? Okay. There is also a group of words that has the com combination. How would this? A U G H. But these words are not so um, complicated because A U G H produce only two sounds. We start uh, with the list of words with O U G H and don't worry, these are nearly all the words of this time that I know. I got this from a website. I actually know there's a lot, a lot of words with O U G H in them, but these are the most common. So, um, words with O U G H. So we have six different sounds in American English. In British English, there's a seventh uh, common sound, but I'm we're I'm looking at American English, and I won't try to use my my bad British accent today. So, um, the first sound is uff, the uff sound like in buff, and words pronounced with uff include tough, rough, and enough. Mm -hmm. There's also off, like cough. You can see that it's spelled the same way, but it's pronounced differently. Cough. And then we have a long O sound, like in Ohio or Tokyo. Although, though, thorough. So again, same O-U-G-H, but it's pronounced like a long O. Then we have the um, oo sound, like in Liverpool, oo, through. So look at the difference between thorough and through. That one little letter changes the word completely. So again, same spelling, O-U-G-H, different sound, through. And we have O-W, how, now, plow, drought. So it makes an ow sound. And notice that when there's a T at the end, you still pronounce the T. It's not silent after O-U-G-H, drought, wow. And then we have the ah sound, like in claw, bought, brought, thought, ah. OK. So you have uff, off, o, u, al, and ah. <laughs> Six different sounds. And then it says, please remember that the suggested sound replaces all four letters of O-U-G-H. But you must pronounce the letter T when it appear appears. So like I just said, if there's a T at the end, it's always pronounced bot, brought, drought. Okay. So yeah, there isn't really a general rule for memorizing um, caught, taught. It's the ah uh, number six, Ferkin. Caught, taught. Um, there's no general rule for kind of memorizing these six. Um, for the most part, you just have to practice and learn them, unfortunately. But the, the more you speak and listen, the more you'll be able to really easily pick up when a word doesn't sound right. Um, yeah, I'll repeat them all one more time. Okay. And if you want, you can repeat them after me. That would probably be a good way to start. Okay, so I'll repeat all three words, and then you can repeat the three after me. So sound number one, uff, tough, rough, enough. Can you repeat them, everybody, at once? <laughs> tough, rough, enough. Tough, rough, enough. Tough, rough, enough. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and then the tough, second rough, sound is enough. good. Off, cough, cough. cough. So in two cough. examples, the GH makes an F sound, like an F, right? But it doesn't no. always. Only if it's an F or an off. Tough, cough. Rough. Rough, yep. Love. Yeah. Laughing. Samantha with 33 teeth taught rough enough in Liverpool during drought. <laughs> Woo, yes, that is a good tongue twister. Off. Uh, okay, and then we have the long O sound, like in Ohio or Tokyo. Although, 
Though. Thorough. Though. Though. Thorough. Although. Or no. Though. Or no. Thorough. 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 Yeah, exactly. So it sounds like throw. It's the same sound as in throw. 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 Thorough. Throw. Although. Thorough. Oh. So just think of it as the whole O U G H is making one long O sound in this example, in number three. And then we have number four, ooh, Liverpool, through. So you can think of O U G H as making the ooh sound. Through. Through. <laughs> through. Through. And again, we're getting a little bit of the TH practice, like what we were doing last week. Through. And then the fifth one is ow, how, now, plow, drought. Ow, now, plow, drought. Ow, ow. So it's like the ow sound. Plow. Plow. The same as plow. Okay. Plow. Ow. And then the sixth sound is ah, like in claw. Bought. Brought, thought. So you can think of these words as being spelt like this: bought, bought brought, bought, brought, shot, brought. The so whole o u g h is replaced with ah. Um, a plow. Like, have you ever heard of a snow plow? No. It's like a big machine that that pushes the snow. Um, yeah. 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 That's a plow. Um. Wrath. Why did you say wrath? Wrath. Wrath. Yeah, it's a silent, silent W. Wrath. Wrath. Yeah. Like, feel like my wrath. Wrath. <laughs> wrath. 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 Is there Gosh. voiceless th sounds? Okay. Wrong. Wrong. Sorry, I got kicked out. Wrong. Okay, is there uh, voiceless <laughs> th sounds? Voiceless th, like wrath. Voiceless. Wrath. Your breath comes out, so it's voiceless. Wrath. Do you understand the difference between voiced and voiceless? I guess so. It's the difference between where it's just air and where it's vibrating and making like a buzz on your teeth. Like this and think. This, this, brother. Those are voiced. This, brother. This, that. Brother, our voice Brother. versus wrath is unvoiced. Thought, wrath. think, wrath. You don't say think, thought, right? You say think, thought, and think. you don't say brother or this. Say brother, <sighs> this. That's the difference. So, um. Voiced teach is like a vibration on your teeth, and voiceless th is like um, air coming out. I guess is the easiest way. <laughs> is there a rule for that? Not really. No. A lot of it is um, memorization and just recognizing the patterns when native speakers are speaking. You would never hear me say this brother. It sound it doesn't come out naturally. It sounds very odd, so you just kind of adjust to the the proper sound. Are you doing that worksheet I gave you from last week? Is that where rath mm -hmm. came from? Yeah, yes. it wouldn't be rath, rath. It's not. It's rath, but it's voiceless. Ah. Okay, let's go back. So again, here are six sounds: uff, off, o, u, ow, ah. Okay different O-U-G-H sounds. And then next I want to look at words with A-U-G-H. 
I have to zoom out a little bit. So A-U-G-H sounds. These words are similar to the O-U-G-H, but A-U-G-H only pr produces two sounds rather than six, so it's a little bit easier. Um, some words in this category are not very common. They are good words, but not as common, like haughty, distraught, onslaught. Those are not common words. Um, so there's two different ways to pronounce A-U-G-H. The first one is a, like claw, daughter, naughty, slaughter, taught, caught. And then if I pronounce this naturally, not so slowly, daughter, naughty, slaughter, the, the T turns into a D sound. Um, and that comes from what we were talking about last week. Bye, Birkin. Bye. Daughter, naughty, slaughter, taught, caught. Can you guys repeat those words after me? Daughter. 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 Naughty. Naughty. Slaughter. 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 Taught. 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 Caught. 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 Good. So Caught. you just have to think of it as sounding like an um, the entire A-U-G-H is being replaced with an ah sound. Caught. Caught. Okay? Caught. All words deriving from these words also have the A-U sound, like granddaughter, naughtier, the naughtiest, etc. So any words deriving from similar words. Naughty, slaughter, taught, caught. So it's the first sound is an ah sound. The second one is an F. It actually makes an F sound, just like with O-U-G-H. The second one is F, like as in half. Laughter, laugh, laughing. Oh, ignore drought. That shouldn't be there. <laughs> laugh. Um, this F sound is nothing else. It replaces all four letters. And again, if there's a T at the end, you have to pronounce it, just like in taught or caught. It's not a silent T at the end. So af, laugh, laughter. The vast majority of the time it's pronounced like ah, daughter. Okay. Any questions so far? Are there any words that you're not sure about how to pronounce them with O-U-G-H or A-U-G-H? Uh, let's I pronounce this word and you will see if uh, I correct pronounce. Okay. Daughter. Yep. Yeah. Exactly. Daughter. 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 Uh, Naughty. How, how correct? Naughty. Sorry? Yes, that's right. Naughty. Um, uh, slaughter. Is that sometimes with slaughter? Yep. Sorry. Sometimes with American pronunciation, the T so, uh, sorry, in the what? middle of the word sometimes makes a D sound. So if you if you want to learn a little bit more about that, you can watch the video back from last week. We were talking about the T making a D sound the last few weeks. So for words like daughter, listen to how I pronounce it. It almost sounds like this, right? Daughter. daughter. But in British English, it would be like daughter. <laughs> so oh, it depends on if it's American or British. Tough. But the main thing to think about today is that it's the ah uh, uh, sound in the middle. Okay. Bye, Louisa. Bye. Okay, ah, uh, daughter. Okay, so I want us to go back and pronounce the whole list, and then we'll do some other. So, how about um, uh, Igor? Can you pronounce these three words? Uh, where? What? What's? Uh, do you see it on my screen? Oh, sorry, I was in, in uh, Google Drive. Oh, One second. Okay. That's okay. Uh, I'm just looking back at the O U G H words. Okay, one second. But I see your photo on uh, my screen. Oh. Okay. Oh, now I see. Um, tough, rough, enough. Correct Good. or not? Yep, perfect. 
And Mustafa, can you pronounce the next word? No? Okay, Peter? Yes. Hi. Could you pronounce this word that I have highlighted? Whoa. Cough. Cough, good. And Sukumar, can you pronounce these three words? Arnold. Good. And Felix, can you pronounce these three? Throw, both, growth. Okay. Um, almost. So we have through, but these two make the ow sound. Plow, drought. Oh, oh. Plow, throw. Yeah, drought. like in how and now. Ow, ow. Plow, drought. And then the last ones are the aw sound. Um, Igor, can you pronounce the last ones? The aw sound? About. Correct? Yep. Brought. How, how to pronounce the last word? Thought. So think of it. Think of it like this. Do you see in the chat? Thought. Mm -hmm. Thought. 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 Brought. Thought. Brought. Bought. Okay. Let's try reading a few sentences, okay? Number one, Paul brought his daughter to class. Saw, Benji. Saw, saw, saw. Um, Felix, can you read number two? I don't have enough dough. Dough, good. And um, Igor, number three? His daughter is proud with this trout thought. How to pronounce this word? Yes, yeah, so it's ah. Just out. repeat after me. Ah. 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 Just drop those words. I don't know. Um, your voice is freeze. I don't know. Uh, I have problem with connection or. Um... Okay. Can you hear me now? Yes. Now I can hear you. Okay. So they're all pronounced with the ah uh, sound. And the thing to remember is that your lips don't wrap up into a W afterwards. You don't go ah uh, ah. Uh. It's not like that. There's no W sound. It's just ah, uh, just the vowel ah. Uh. Uh. Mm -hmm. Okay. Ah, uh, not ah uh, ah. Uh. You don't you don't wrap your lips around the W. So in all of these words, it's with the ah uh, sound, and your mouth stays open for the whole sound. He's, so daughter. His, da his daughter is fraught with distraught thoughts. Yes, that was better. Except for the last word, you did the W sound. Thoughts. 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 Yes. Thoughts. Perfect. 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 So it's just a matter of not not making the w w. There's no W. It's just ah, just open. Yeah, that was good. Okay, let's try the next one. Um, Mustafa, is your microphone working? Yes. Okay. Do you want to try number four? Okay, uh, we bought bikes to ride through the park. Through the park, yes. Number five, Sukumar? Yeah. Do you want to try number yeah. five? Yeah. I'm not distraught even though I cough. Okay. And Toyet, number six? Yeah. I saw the top pass. For not. Perfect. Perfect. And Benji, do you want to try number seven? 
she cough throughout the class? Yep. Good. And Felix, number eight. I thought you bought a donut, Paul. Perfect. And Igor, number nine. We got a bore. How to pronounce bore? Bore. Bore. Bore and bout a throat. A trough. 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 It's trough. the off sound. Off. Trough. Trough. Um, do you know what a boar is? No. A boar is like a big wild pig, like one of those oh. big black pigs. Okay, There's okay, I know. Show lost. They have like wild boars in that. Yes, yes, wild pig, I you know. What is. Mm. is it a slang? Pardon? No, it's not slang. No? Oh, no, okay. it's just the name of the animal. It's a boar. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. And one more, number 10, uh, Mustafa? Mustafa? Yes. Do you want to try number 10? I ought not have uh, thought such a nitty thoughts. Naughty. Uh, naughty. 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 I ought not have thought such naughty thoughts. <laughs> They're all the awe sound. Okay. All right, good. Any yes. any questions about pronouncing any other words so far? Uh, about sound I. The teacher is going to think so. Oh. Hello. Sorry, I got kicked out. <laughs> um, did you, you guys have any questions about any others? Drati. Yes. Drati isn't a word. You can say drought, and that means it's uh, very dry. Or you can say naughty, which means um, bad behaving, badly behaving. Um, shown is the O sound. O, long O. Shown. 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 Yeah, long O. <coughs> um, drought is pronounced with an O-U-G-H-T like this, and drought means a very dry spell. Like if, if, um, if there isn't rain somewhere for months and months, and the crops are all drying out, um, you would say that it's the middle of a drought. No, known, no, 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 oh, no, show, although, those words all rhyme. So it's a long mm -hmm. O. And the past Rat, participle, rat, noun, true. is noun or known? Um, that's a, dra a way of spelling draft, Toya, draft, and it means like a blueprint, draft. Um, or you can have a draft beer, the type of beer. Um, a lot of the time it's, it's spelt this way. It can be spelt both ways. I'm not sure about how to work Hangouts from the iPad. Sorry. Yeah, so those are all um, examples of the long O, um, Benji. Any other questions so far? To together, word, how to pronounce. Together. Together. Uh, together. 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 The, the together. The, together. 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 Yeah. It's really it's the th that's hard. And, yeah. Together. Together. Brother. Together. So last week we were talking about th pronunciation, and there's two different ways to pronounce th. 
There's a voiceless TH that's like breathy, like where breath actually comes out of your mouth. That's how you pronounce words like th. Um, sorry. Um, the. What? Um, Without the. Without the. Yeah, brother. So there's two. There's voiceless Without where it's the. like in thought or think, and then there's the voiced th. 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 Where it vibrates, and that's in words like brother, together. And how, how do you know uh, where uh, to pronounce with um, voiceless? Uh... There aren't, unfortunately, there's not really a rule. It's just one of those things where you have to listen to native speakers and practice. But there and, are two. Um, uh, for example, uh, exist a number of words like these and kids. Uh, e, uh, we pronounce E uh, with I with um, um, you understand these, what I ask? These? And this? No, no. The yes. For example, these and this. How do you know e where to pronounce uh, I sound? Um, it's a soft. It's generally speaking, it's a soft I if there's not an E at the end of the word. So the difference is bit. Bite. The e at the end of the word makes it a long, long i sound. Bit, bite. Mm -hmm. E See? at the word makes uh, i sound uh, more pronounced. Yes. Right. Putting an e at the end of a word makes the vowel in the middle of the word a long vowel. For example, oh, okay. um, pat, hate, bit. Mm -hmm. Bite. Hat, um, hate. I'm trying to think of one with e. Um, pet, peat. Do you see? Oh, yes, yes. I see. The e at the end makes the makes the vowel in the middle a long vowel. Trough. And, trough. and uh, this is uh, only this rule, or uh, exist another rules for this kind of words? Um, that's the main rule. That's the main rule. There are and some other little rules, but that's that's the main one that you need to know. And uh, uh, rather, rather, how to pronounce it? Rather, rather, rather. rather. And, uh, can can uh, you listen? I, how I pronounce and correct me. Rather, rather. It's just the, the end. It should be more like er than r. Er, er. Er. Rather, rather. Yeah, that's better. Rather, rather. rather. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Um, okay. Let's do some practice. So let me just find my. Here we go. So we have this story, and what we need to do. I'm going to share my screen. Is read it together. And, and highlight the words with O U G H, and then afterwards we're going to figure out how to pronounce each of these words. But we'll just do it as we go. Okay? So I have my highlighter tool out. So we'll take turns reading sentences, and you can tell me what um, how to pronounce the different words. So let's start with uh, Benji. Can you read the first sentence? Uh, I'm sorry, I cannot see anything. Okay, can you guys see it on my screen? Okay, now right now, yes. Click my video at the bottom if you can't, if you're having trouble. Okay, go ahead, Banshee. Okay. Once upon a time, there was an English student who thought that he could find enough thought doth to fill his broth, broth, Burrow. Okay, so we have okay. thought mm -hmm. enough tough, tough dough burrow. Oh. Once upon a time there was an English student who thought that he could find enough tough dough to fill his burrow. 
So thought, which sound is it? I'll give you the list of sounds again. We've got um, uff, off, o, u, ow, and ah. Okay, those are all the o, u, g, h sounds. So this first word, thought, thought, which sound is it? Ah, good. And can you repeat the word? Thought. 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 Good. Okay, Thought. next word. Enough. 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 Which, Enough. which sound is that? Good. It's off. Good. Tough. Enough. So. Next one is tough. 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 Yeah. Off again. Good. Tough. Tough. So it's not though. Here's the. We have tough. Though, no. thorough, <laughs> you see the different pronunciations? <laughs> tough, though, thorough, through. So this one is tough, like the F sound. Next one is do, 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 do. Which which o u g h sound is that? It's not it's not oo not oo, do. O w. Nope. Just o. Long o. Do do. It just sounds like do, d o. <laughs> or like Homer Simpson where he goes do. That's what it sounds like. <laughs> you watch the Simpsons. Do. <laughs> and then we have um, burrow, 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 burrow. Do, Perkin. There's a difference. It's the long O sound, and doughty is ow. Burrow. Okay, so let's try the whole sentence again. Um, Benji, can you try reading mm -hmm. this sentence again? The same sentence? Yep. Now that you know okay. how to pronounce them all. Um, I gotta try. Okay. <laughs> once, upon <laughs> once upon a time, there was an English student who thought that he could find enough thaw. Yes? Yep. Thaw. Da. Do. 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 Is yep. To yep. fill his burrow. Yay! Yeah, Good job. Yes. The, <laughs> last, yeah. the last one sounds though. like burro in Spanish. <laughs> yeah. La so the last one sounds his... donkey <laughs> in Spanish. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, Felix, can you do the next two sentences? It's short. He sought for it everywhere. And the next one? Uh, yes. uh, when he went to the store, he bought as much as he could. Good. So those two rhyme. They're both the ah sound. Bought, sought. Bought, sought. Okay, perfect. Um, Igor, can you do the next sentence? Yes. Um, uh, where? While on vacation? Yep. While on vacation, he brought back some back some from the neighboring cities. And maybe you'll do the next one as well. Things were... how to pronounce this? Were. 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 Things were getting rough and although he, he had a cold and a bad cough, he still managed... managed? Yep. Uh, with T sound. Or managed. 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 Yep. managed. Managed. To plow, plow, how plow. to plow, plow, throw the winter as though, how to pronounce? As though. Though he were well. Okay. So first thing I'm going to do is just pause and do the were and where, okay? 
Okay. W E R E is were. 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 W H E R and W E A R and W A R E is where. Where. The only time you ever pronounce it were is when it's spelled W E R E. Were. Were. Where. Where. Yeah, that's a pretty common one. Um, mix the, it's easy to mix it up with pronunciation. Yeah. Um, so let's let's go yeah. back to our O U G H's. So we've got brought. Can you repeat after me? Brought. 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 So which O U H? Which which O U G H sound is that? Brought. Ah, uh, W. Brought. Yes, good. Ah. Uh. And then the next one is rough. Rough. rough, rough. Uff, good. Although, 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 although. Yeah, it's not o. Oh, it's not u. U. It's o. Oh, long o. Although. 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 Yes, good. Although. And then the next one, cough. 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 Yes, off, good, cough. Next one, plow. Blow. Plow. Blow. Which sound is that? Ow, plow. But what is least with sounds? It's the OW. Here, I'll give you the list again. Off, off, o, u, ow, ah. <laughs> okay. Plow. Plow. Ow. Good. And then through. 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 Oof. Through. Good. And uh, though. 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 O W. Though. Though. Yeah, it's the. Though, though, long o, o, o. Though. And again, if if you guys need help with the th, um, you could. I would recommend looking at the last two weeks pronunciation classes. I can find you the links if you want them. Um, but we talked about different th sounds. Um. Okay. Keep going. So. Um, Igor, can you read those two sentences again? Now that you know how to pronounce the words. <laughs> yes, I know, but I uh, don't remember because it's okay. uh, for me, for me, it's try your uh, best. <laughs> yes, I try my best. But okay. <laughs> while because I knew in English, uh, while <laughs> on vacation, uh, he brought back some from the neighboring neighboring. Mm -hmm. Yep, yeah, neighboring cities. Cities. Things uh, were were yep. getting rough, and although he had a cold and a bad cough, cough. Yep, cough. Cough. He still managed 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 to plow 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 through the Good. winter. The winter, as thought, though, yep, he were well. Perfect. Good. Um, quick, very quick review about ed endings. Managed is a is a voiceless sound, so it ends in a voiceless. Oh, <coughs> where is the teacher? Oh. Teacher is bank. Sorry, I keep getting I saw, <laughs> I saw her hand. I'm right here. Beautiful okay. teacher. So, um... Sorry, I got kicked out. I wanted to quickly go over ED endings very quickly. So managed, it's a, 
that um, voiceless sound. So it ends in voiceless T, managed, versus um, managed. Yeah, it's not managed. The only time that you pronounce it id like that is if the word ends in a T or a D, like um, um, e -D. Here, I have to, one second. Manage it. I'm going to give you guys, yeah. like, for example, um, painted. Painted. Manage. It ends in the teeth. You pronounce it ed, id, painted. Okay. Painted. Here's a Manage. resource Manage. if you need help um, practicing ed. That gives you a pretty good review of ED endings, okay? <laughs> okay, let's keep going with our our O-U-G-H. He continued his search. Um, Mustafa, do you want to try the next one? Yes. Uh, he continued his search. He fought long and hard. And the next sentence? Uh, he he wrote he wrote yes he wrote night and day in his endeavor endeavor, endeavor. for enough thought though enough tough dough enough tough dough oops sorry sorry Zinu I thought you had an echo managed not managed not Managed. 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 Okay. He fought. He fought. No, Zinu. It's not managed. It's not managed. It's managed. 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 Okay. He fought long and hard. He oh, fought night and day. Hard. Sorry, Zinu. He fought long and hard. He wrought night and day on his endeavor for enough tough dough. So we have fought. Which sound is that? Fought. 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 I'll give you the sounds one more time. Chad, there's the sounds. Good. Ah, perfect. Rot. Rot. Okay. Rot. W. Zinu, you have an echo, so just make sure that you only have the hangout open, okay? Uh oh. Okay. W uh, is silent. Rot. 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 Yeah, it's Rot. a silent W. Mm. Which o u which o u g h sound is that? Rot. Rot. Rot, rot. It's the ah sound, right? Um, then we have enough. Enough. Yep, enough. good. Uh, enough, tough. Do. Do. Tough is also the uh sound. And then do. Which sound is that? Do. Do. Oh. Good. Long o, like this. O. Oh. Okay, perfect. Let's do one more. Uh, Sukumar? Yeah. Can you read the next yeah. sentence? Yeah, finally, after many months, he thought that his thorough search had to come to an end. Okay. He thought that his thorough, thorough. search ought to come to an end. Is it thorough or is thorough? Thorough. Yep, thorough. 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 He thought that his thorough search ought. So we have thought, thorough, and ought. Can you guys repeat them? Thought, thorough, ought. Good. And then you see the difference between through and thorough. Through, thorough. Through, thorough. So through sounds like this, and thorough sounds like this. Through, thorough, 
And ought mm -hmm. is the A-W sound. Ought. Ought. Oh. Can you read it one more time for us, Sukma? Yeah. Finally, after many months, he thought that his thorough search ought to come to an end. Perfect. And Toya, do you want to do the next uh, two sentences for us? Yeah. And one day, he did, when by chance he came upon a very old tree. Next to the tree was an old horse truck. Um, you can just finish it, do the last one as well. And and on the and on the boughs of the tree he saw enough tough dough to fill his burrow. The end. The so end. evidently, um this story doesn't really make sense. <laughs> But um, it's just trying to get some practice. Um, oh. I keep Hello. getting kicked out. Oh. Okay. So we have um, three minutes. Yes, three minutes, and I'm just trying to get back to my screen, but I'm having some hangout issues. Okay. Just a second. Okay. An old horse trough. Trough. Do you know what a horse trough is? I wonder if Mustafa knows. <laughs> No? No. No. It's um it's like the place where a horse or a pig you usually hear trough when you're talking about a pig. It's like where you put their feed and they eat. It's kind of a rectangular container. The trough for an animal. Um yeah, next to the uh, tree was an old horse trough and on the boughs of the tree he saw enough tough dough to fill his burrow. Trough, bow, enough, tough, dough, burrow. <laughs> okay. <laughs> it's difficult. Okay, so trough, which sound do you hear with trough? Trough. Here's the, here's the list again. It's off. actually, it's off, off. Um, let me get oh, you the... Uh, sure. Here we go. We've got uff, off, o, u, ow, off. Trough, trough is off. Bows, bows. Ow, ow, bow. It's like if somebody punches you in the arm and you're like, ow. <laughs> That's the sound. Bow. Enough. 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 Off. Uh, good. Not enough. It, enough would be off. But we say enough exactly like that. Enough. That would be a very big spelling error if you spelled it like that on a test or something. Um, puff. 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 Oh. Puff. Puff. Oh. Good. Do. Do. Burrow. Burrow. Good. Do. 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 Burrow. They're both long O. Do. Burrow. Burrow. Do. Okay. Yes. So, does anyone have any questions? We're just about out of time. Excellent. So, yeah, there's, there's six different. Pardon? Excellent teacher. Oh, thanks. Um, if you want the handout, it's on Google Drive. So you can uh, save it to your computer if you want it from there. And I'm teaching the next class. It's a beginner class. So maybe I'll see some of you there. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome. Bye -bye. Thank you. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Thank you.